Um, the UN recently stated that more than 7 million Somalis, which is pretty much close to half the population of the country, uh, facing crisis level food insecurity. Uh, and that's because of uh, a, a fourth failed rainy season, uh, huge inflation uh, over 10 percent uh, and what we're seeing, which is a very underfunded humanitarian response. Um, and of of those seven million, uh, just under quarter of a million Somalis are really at risk of famine, you know, and starvation, uh, which is a huge increase uh, since the beginning of this year. Um, and there are many areas of the country, uh, pastoralist regions, northeast and the centre of the country, which are uh, affected, including you know some of the worst. Uh, areas which include IDP camps around around the capital and other towns um, and, and this is being exacerbated of course because of uh, global geopolitics the 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 war in Ukraine uh, I mean Somalia was importing the majority over 90 percent of its wheat imports as many other neighboring countries were from Ukraine and Russia uh, and that has really impacted uh the country humanitarian organizations writ large uh global food prices reaching all-time high as well as a result of that which means that those humanitarian agencies are really struggling not only to to bring in those much needed uh food emergency aid but, but having a lack of supplies themselves uh, due to the increase in those prices uh, and, and and the likelihood is you know we're going to see that worse and president hassan sheikh mohammed has made this a priority and he's also appointed uh, a special representative for drought as well in, uh, uh, very early on in his government